like really out of tune so much to the point like the E string is like so loose like it bounces um I've never tuned a bass before so this will be a new experience for me but yeah I used to play the cello for like three years in middle school though so it was a long time ago I feel like the bass and the cello there are some like parallels between them I'm hoping that will kind of like help me to like regain the small knowledge that I have from playing an instrument yeah I'm gonna plug it in and try to tune it to the best I can and it's like an orchestra we have fine tuners on the cello not just the pegs and so I've never I've actually never used pegs before because I would always just use the fine tuner in orchestra so let's see if I can do it Usually I put petroleum jelly like on my forehead and on the back of my neck, but I can't find it so I'm just gonna try not to get it everywhere. I don't have to do my roots because they're brown, so at least it won't be like on my scalp. These gloves are so small. I'm gonna be using the Manic Panic, the Vampire Red. This one's like my all-time favorite. Even when I didn't have like bright red hair, I still use this shade and it would come out like really dark and pretty. I feel like red is such like a flattering hair color like on every skin tone. Like I feel like you could never just like go wrong with it. So I've been doing red for like a very very long time. Oh, I already got it on my face. But yeah, you don't have to bleach your hair for red, but I wanted to, so I wanted mine to, like, stay red. Sometimes when you don't bleach it, like, it'll be red for, like, a week, and then after that, it's not. I used to use the L'Oreal, like, highlighted ones for dark hair, and they would work, but it just, like, wasn't as red as I wanted it to be. I got it all.
prescription. And you can only get it from Red like on three from Red Mountain Weight Loss right now and use keyword Red. signed up to do like an art market and I've been kind of just like working on everything today and getting stuff together um so yeah I have like pretty much everything like set up that I need today I just was working on making like hair clips so that I had like a little extra something to sell and they came out really cute I think I wish I made more but I just kind of gave up because my fingers hurt making them that's gonna be tomorrow the markets tomorrow and so I'm really excited I told myself I was never gonna sell at a market again but then my boyfriend's performing there and I just thought why not why not sell my stuff anyways right now I'm gonna go to the grocery store because we don't have butter and I wanted to make my boyfriend cookies to surprise him and then I'm gonna make some raspberry thumbprint cookies and I can't wait because they're like one of my favorite cookies so yeah. Oh, it's so cute.
Okay, so I'm finally done getting ready. I did my makeup kind of crazy. I don't really know what's going on, but yeah, it took me a long time to get ready. And I still have to like make sure that I have everything. I always feel like that I'm missing something and I don't know until I get there. It's probably like a good idea to make a list, but I think it's too late at this point. So we're just gonna go with the flow. Um, let me show y'all my outfit. I'm wearing this uh, shirt that I got off eBay. It's like a mesh shirt. And then this is my necklace that I made. And then this is a skirt. Jean-Paul Gaultier. 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 Um, I got off Poshmark for like 40 bucks. And then these socks. I forgot what brand they're from, but I did get them off Essence on sale. And then these are New Balance shoes. <laughs> So I'm going to a Death Grips concert tomorrow and I'm just a little, just a little nervous only because I'm just scared I'm going to get trampled on because it's like general admission and it's all on the same floor. I think it'll be fine as long as I try to avoid like the pit area. I don't, I don't know how it's going to be um, based on the stories I've seen of people like on Reddit. Um, people... Are crazy and I'm hoping to have like a good experience tomorrow I just I'm just there for the music
So today I woke up, someone purchased from my Etsy shop! <laughs> I'm so excited because I honestly thought that like nobody was gonna buy anything and my Etsy was just gonna be up for like ever. But like I'm just glad, I'm really thankful that one person was able to just kind of look at it and say, hey, that's worth spending the money on. But yeah, I'm just really, really happy and really excited. If you want to check out the video of me setting up my Etsy, it was my last video and yeah. I'm just gonna make the package for it now and send it out.